This is not a toy. This is China's next consumer AI terminal. For 30 years, made in China meant cheap toys. That era is over. What China is building now are AI companions, not toys. And this isn't about kids. It's about how AI quietly enters everyday life. This thing listens, remembers, some even simulate a heartbeat. In supply chain terms, this is AI plus hardware plus emotional interface. The plush is just a shell. The intelligence inside is where the value lives. This is happening now for three reasons. First, policy. China's AI plus strategy is pushing every industry to integrate AI. Even toys are now a priority sector. Second, cost. Chinese AI models are dramatically cheaper, which means real intelligence can live inside a $50 product. Third, speed. Ideas go from prototype to shelf in months, not years. That combination is rare. Here's a hidden logic most people miss. This isn't one company's innovation. It's a regional system advantage. Shenzhen handles AI chips and modules. Dongguan does rapid hardware integration. Chenghai produces toys at massive scale. Logistics ships globally in days. That's why this category is scaling so fast in China and almost nowhere else. If you are evaluating this space, don't ask, is the toy smart? Ask this instead, who controls the ecosystem? Margins aren't in the plush. They are in AI model access, data feedback loops, emotional user retention. Toy factories that stay just factories will be squeezed. Those that integrate AI move up the value chain. This is why adults are buying these too. In China, they call it the emotional economy. These aren't gadgets. These are companions that need care. And once people emotionally attach to a device, switching becomes very hard. That's real stickiness. So remember this, China doesn't commercialize AI by selling technology. It commercializes AI by hiding it inside products. AI toys are just the beginning. I'm Eric. Think of me as your buyer office in China. If you are looking at AI hardware, consumer products, or supply chain strategy here, send me a message with what you are exploring, and I'll help you think it through. See ya.